Good day guys, how are you all? I'm your surely the original Spikey D and today on Spikey Reacts 2 we will be doing a review of a trailer that was requested by Bino Sharon. Bino Sharon is one of my subscribers and he requested that I do this particular trailer. But before I get into the details of this particular trailer, I would like to bring to your attention the following. The purpose of the channel is to promote and to highlight content that is coming out of Asia and not necessarily one country or one industry. So moving forward and in the effort to please everyone, the channel will be featuring content that is coming out, out of India, South Korea, China, Thailand, etc. So beginning in the new month, we will be featuring content out of India on Sunday nights and Friday nights at 8.30 p.m. Eastern Time. On a Tuesday night, we will be featuring content exclusively for South Korea, Thailand, Indonesia, and China. That is just a little idea of where the channel will be heading into the future. Now today we will be featuring a action crime drama out of the Malayan film industry. It is a film that came out back in 2018 and the name of the film is Ranam. Now this as I said was requested by Baino Sharan who is a subscriber to the channel. It is starring Pitviraj Sukamaran, Rahman and Isha Talwa and it's directed by Nirmal Sahadev. Now I'm not sure about if I had the pronunciations of those names correct. I'm not familiar with any of these actors except that I know that Prithviraj was featured in Driving License. Without further ado, let's check this one out. <laughs> Thinking this might be a repeat of Toronto? Minimum or three thousand dollars in the Red X Kachodana. First of all, this doesn't appear as, as if it's film in India. And I'm not going to let that happen. But the I live was gonna These talo, she will okay. Yeah, nay. I'm gonna wait for you to negativity flow to my energy. I'm feeling it my energy flowing all the way then me. Rap music. Are you the major now? First of all, the film doesn't have the look and feel of an Indian film or a film that came out of India. Actually, it looks more like a film out of Hollywood. Every scene, every shot was as if it was in America. The genre of the film seems to be one of the mafia, the underworld, um, gangsters. Usually, these genre of films tends to be a bit slow, very violent at times. The runtime on this movie is 136 minutes, so that's over two hours. So hopefully the plot will be engaging enough and gripping enough that can hold your attention and not have you sleeping on yourself. The trailer itself look engaging. The acting did seem strong. The cinematography didn't give me a wow feeling. The trailer itself, although it did look like a Hollywood type of film, it didn't engage me enough to say that I would want to go to the theaters to see this film. As usual, you know, we will check out IMBD to get an idea of the synopsis of the film. And on IMBD, it says 
Trapped in a life of crime, a mysterious getaway driver lives with this code of conduct and protects his only friend. When he meets someone who can potentially change his entire world, he yearns at a chance for redemption. Well, that's my honest thoughts on this trailer, but I will say this, I wasn't expecting a trailer that will be featured heavily in the US. So hopefully the direction and the storytelling and the plot, as I said earlier on, is good and gripping and engaging enough to hold your attention for 136 minutes. So. That's my thoughts guys, I'm yours truly, the original Spikey D. So guys, as usual, thank you for stopping by and thank you for watching to the end and I hope you would like and you would subscribe and that you would share with your friends and that you will keep coming back for more. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.